Today, you had to tattoo your state. Each of your tattoos have been ranked by the judges. One by one, the top 12 artists will be revealed. I actually wanted to say something before we move forward. Okay, go ahead, bud. I'm actually bowing out of the competition. What do you mean? Why? I mean, we haven't even started yet. Yeah, I know, dude. I just don't want to crank out any more tattoos that I'm not happy with, so... Drew, I, you I, can do this, dude. You're looking at it as, I may fuck this up again. Why not look at it as, I may crush it? The whole environment is its not like what I expected it to be. I don't think anybody can, like, ex like expect what's on the other side. You can't run away from the things that make you uncomfortable because your biggest moment of growth is gonna be in the moment that you think you can't make it. This competition, like everything uh, that, that goes into it, all the moving parts that go into it, it just it's, it wouldn't allow me to produce like the best quality of tattooing that, that I was able to do. New York, Lady Liberty. I like the concept and obviously I like how this fills the space. The outlines just look like they were done in a bumpy car. Jacked. You know what makes me really happy about this tattoo? That lets me know now that you are no competitor in this competition. I'm not willing to like roll the dice and, and gamble with somebody's skin and, and you know do a tattoo that like I'm not able to perform at my best. So I, I like the as serious as the competition is and as much as I respect it, um, I would rather uh, kind of like bow out instead of doing a tattoo I'm not proud of again. If you want to excuse yourself, you're welcome to. I'm good with my decision. Let him go. Let him go. I'll see you guys around, dude. Fucking crush it. Let's make a pact. No one else is quitting. No. I'm happy with my decision, and I'm, I'm happy that I'm not going to be moving forward doing tattoos that I'm not happy with. I, I, I realize the situation is just not for me, and, you know, I'd rather pull myself out of it than continue half-heartedly. Let's move on and focus on what we came here to do. Yes. Let's do it. Today, you had to face off for your survival creating patriotic tattoos. For me, I see Emac struggled. I think that Nichelle struggled. Jason has the most problems, technically. I'd much rather walk out with Jason's tattoo. I hear you, man. Emac gave us a small little tattoo with a few flaws. Jason gave us a big, huge tattoo with a ton of flaws. I don't see the proper whip. I don't see the solid black silhouette. There's tons of problems. My vote is for Jason. For me, there's problems in the Liberty Bell. Doesn't have a punch in black. It doesn't have a clean outline. It's probably the one that shows the least amount of fundamentals. My vote's for Nichelle. One vote for Jason, one vote for Nichelle. I go back and forth between the two and I gotta fall down on Nichelle. <laughs> the judges have decided, Nichelle, you do not have what it takes to be Ink Master. Wow. I'm surprised that I'm going home because I think even they knew like I did a good tattoo. I know where I messed up, but I do have the technical skill not to throw you under the bus, bro, but it took your whole team to help you pull three arrows. The Are you gonna be you able to tattoo the, you the rest it? of the competition you you like that? Not. I'm a better, I'm fundamentally... You may be, but you wasn't on this tattoo. I'm not going home. Emac messed up his tattoo completely and then had someone basically help him completely design his tattoo. Teamwork makes the makes dream, the dream work. work. That's right. You know. I think my flaws in tattooing aren't as troublesome as someone who can't tattoo without causing trauma to the skin or blending colors or just understanding how to tattoo in general, just like the basics. Of shading. It definitely has an unfinished feel to it. Pretty much nowhere in the tattoo you have any really rich, solid black. The only place that you did put it was behind your image. I feel like my tattoo was one of the stronger out of the group, along with a lot of the people in the competition. It's the way it fell, and I think you just got the jitters. Please pack your machines and head out. Uh, what makes me the most upset is that bad tattoos get to stay, and a quote-unquote beautiful tattoo is the first to go home. Sorry, I don't mean to be a bitch.